So today, saving time and money by improving workflow processes. Um, let's just do some definitions first of all. Uh, time and money, obviously that's pretty um, self-explanatory. Um, so we're not going to talk today about cutting edge stuff or the latest in um, thinking. We're going to get back to some basics today. Um, and so time and money is pretty basic. Uh, we're talking about not just profits, but we're also talking about minimising risk. We're talking about making cl clients more satisfied um, and also about improving staff morale and also about improving staff retention. So all of these strategies that we'll talk about today hopefully will um, help us to accomplish these things. The definition of workflows, a lot of people have def different definition of workflows. Today we're not just going to talk about the fancy flowcharts of how you, you actually conduct a legal claim. Um, although that will be covered in our session today, we're mainly just talking about um, making uh, your processes more efficient. We're talking about uh, not getting new software in, but using your current software more efficiently. We're talking about taking your existing procedures and just making them more um, efficient, uh, different ways of doing jobs in a better and more time effective way. So really that's what we're talking about today. So I'm not going to be doing any huge um, acronyms like ROWEs or LPOs or even ROIs. We're just going to just get back down to basic law firm management 101. So we could talk about different ways that we could save time and money in various areas, but today I'm going to concentrate on six um, and what we're going to concentrate today on is some causes of waste that we find in document production, uh, in what I call knowledge, in training, paper, which might in, in interest law and order, very much so, uh, the financial side of things and also processes. So we are actually going to look at some solutions today and you'll see that they're just quickly listed up on the screen for you. What I'm going to do with each of these solutions is we'll talk about the problem, we'll talk about how it causes waste, then we'll demonstrate a solution. So we're not just going to talk about the solution, we'll actually show you some screenshots and how different firms are actually solving these problems and then how each of these solutions um, saves time and money in the long run. 